Dean. Yes, sir. Gary Antoine Russell, Kent Cruz. Gary Antoine, taking on another unbeaten fighter you got here. Um, give us a sense of what he, of what we're going to see Saturday night. You're basically, what, eight miles from the pad. So uh, what, what, what is he, what are we going to see Saturday night? A great day performance. First and foremost, I want to say I was gone far too long to feel good to be back. You know, so um, come fight night, I'm pretty sure he's gonna bring his physical best, and I'm gonna bring everything I need to bring as far as to put the fire out. You know, I love it, Kid. What would it mean to you to come on the scene, come in this man's basically his backyard? and give him his first professional loss, what would all of that mean to you on Saturday? Uh, first and foremost, I want to thank God. You know, without God, none of this would be possible. I want to thank you know, everybody that made this possible, Showtime, TGV Promotions, uh, Louis de Cuba, I want to thank my team as well. And uh, I think uh, beating Russell will mean everything for me, you know, for my career. This is uh, what we've been waiting on, you know, our whole career. And uh, a fighter like Russell, you know, in his backyard, I think it's going to bring the best out of me. You know, his, his, his ability, everything that he does is going to make us up our, up our level and up our ability as well. You know, come play that. What do you think people are going to be saying about Kid Cruz? Listen, St. Louis knows you. What do you think the country is going to be saying, the boxing public is going to be saying about Kid Cruz after Saturday night? Uh, they're going to be surprised. I'm, I'm going to, you know, I had a terrific camp, you know, with my, with my team back home. Uh, we worked on, we brought in a lot of stuff of the old Kid Cruz, you know. We went back to our old traits, you know, using the ability that we've been using, you know, uh, early in our career. So I think they're, they're going to be surprised, man. You know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to shock the world come on a Saturday night for sure. Gary Antoine, listen, you come from a fighting family. You come from some talented, talented brothers. You're the only one still unbeaten. The only one. In fact, besides you, Artur Betabiev, Virgil Ortiz, you guys are the only unbeaten fighters ranked by ring who have knocked out all of their opponents. How important is it for you to keep that streak going? Um, honestly, uh, it's, a, it's a good thing to have that streak, but the object of this, this whole sport is to continue to win. You know, um, it'll be a notch under my belt. And I continue, I, I plan to continue that. Um, it's not really a big weight on my shoulders and keep that knockout streak going. If anything, it's, it's up to me to perform at my highest peak. You know, executing everything that I need to execute. That's the plan going in the fight. That's, that's what's going to get me victorious. Kid. Third straight Southpaw that you're facing. Will you be the Southpaw Slayer once again on Saturday night? Uh, yeah, I mean, I feel it's, like you said, it's my third Southpaw. Uh, we've been training for Southpaw in the last couple camps, last three camps. So it's not, it made it easier for me, you know, to just maintain what we've been doing. And uh, absolutely, I, I love fighting Southpaws, to be honest. You know, I, I find it, you know. I find it uh, with the shots that I throw, and it, it makes it a little easier for me you know, to set up the things that I want to do by Southpaws. Gary Antoine, he's unbeaten, and he's certainly had a lot of success against Southpaws. Talk to us about what should he expect, though, on Saturday. Pain. You know, <laughs> pain. You know, the hurt business. Um, someone old gets to go. It's that simple. Um, at the end of the day, I'm gonna make sure that I take my head off to him, you know, good, respectful sportsmanship, and uh, I'm gonna let everybody know here that I do it for the art. I do it for the love of the sport, you know, and definitely doing something back in my hometown is almost like I'm representing my area. If I get good grades, it makes the family look good, right? It's that simple. Uh, he's just another opponent that's in front of me that's standing in the way of my goals. What is everyone going to be saying about Gary Antoine Russell after Saturday night? He's a beast. He's a beast. 
I love it. Ken, same question to you. Where are they gonna be sending out King Cruz after Saturday night? Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna shock the world, man. Like I said, a lot of people, you know, they, they think that, you know, I, I feel like they're gonna look past me. You know, they're looking past me this fight, but we we're we're gonna wake them up. We're gonna wake them up for sure. And I think this this fight, you know, him being in his own town, I feel like he got more pressure than me, you know. It's easier for me to fight him, you know. I feel like he's the one with the pressure, he's the one, you know, with everything on him, so I just gotta do my part, you know, come victorious Saturday night and get our hair raised. No matter what it takes, we're gonna do whatever it takes to get our hair raised come Saturday night. I uh, promise you that. I love that. Uh, last word here, Gary Antoine said, boy, all that pressure is on you. You are at home, got the family here, got that unbeaten streak going. What do you think about that? Pressure to make diamonds. Life is here. Pressure was part to make diamonds. If anything, I'm at ease. I love it. I love it. Folks, a couple unbeaten. That is the co-main event. And now we get to the main event.